I just realized today how much your mindset affects your income. Hey guys, I'm the Enchantress. I was thinking about money blocks today, having intention behind actions and things that you do, and just why I'm where I'm at, and just life. And I had a conversation with a friend today that changed my life. And if you're not having conversations with your friends that change your lives, you're doing it wrong because they are out there, they do exist. Box that I had that were holding me back. Maybe these are something that you're struggling with too because I just saw firsthand how your mindset controls your whole reality. It was holding me back in so many ways because I'm not physically out working, like putting in hours away somewhere because my work is pretty much passive for the most part. I associate that with being broke because my old belief was that I had to work so hard, I had to put in hours, all this stuff, any kind of work, any kind of vibrancy to myself, and that's the only way to make money. So I was still carrying that mindset. So because I associated being at home with being broke and needing things and not being wealthy, I attracted that to myself and have thus put myself in a pretty broke bitch vibe by struggling to pay her rent. I show you the amount of money that I made last month. You're not going to believe that I'm struggling to pay my $830 rent today. And you want to know who I'm mad at about that? Myself. But I'm also grateful at my little self that she finally woke up and realized this about herself. This is what I made last month. As you can see, it's just energy I'm talking about. Money in, money out. What is wrong with me? Why am I struggling to pay $830 rent when that was my income? Because of money blocks. Things that weren't in my awareness, that now are, thanks to the conversation with my friend. Solar eclipse energy, things are being shed to light and I'm so grateful that that did. Because enough's enough. I was like, I don't wanna live like this anymore. I don't want to struggle for a minute. I refuse, I've already had that. I don't want it anymore. I'm a high vibe. I want to give people high vibes. I wanna bless people. I wanna help people and love people. I wanna give my kids the best experience in life they fully can. And money does that, money brings freedom. That could be another money blog that you don't think you deserve it, that spiritual people shouldn't be wealthy. That holds you back. Maybe maybe you think like me, that you're like, you have to struggle and work hard to like be any kind of way and show that you have what, like a character or something? I don't know what it proves, but you might have that twist in your head that you think that you need to do that. You don't, that's a blog. You really need to just rest up and be open for spirit to bring good things and like, that was a struggle for me too because like i'm telling you like when i got home i like put down on my desk i'm like hey i'm gonna find a thousand bucks today like let's go my girl she messaged me and like even the old five of me like i wanted to like not even engage with the conversation because i'm like girl you can't pay your bills like you can't be talking to somebody right now like you shouldn't be having any fun <laughs> see how toxic that is but it's just like those were the environments that i was around <clears throat> that i exposed myself to so that, that thinking's there and like those things hold you back financially. I believe that I created the life that I live now and I believe that I attracted it to me and I believe that I can change it. And when I'm having this conversation with my friend, I get a text about my rent being able to be paid. Wow. Again, universe proves to me I didn't have to lift a finger. I can sit in my femininity and that energy of receiving, it's so unusual to me. But like, I can't, I can't argue with it when it happens to me so frequently. That income that I showed you, my job, like the respite work that I do, I think it was like $4,596. That's all I made from that. The rest is pure magic. Like, is that enough? The realization, is that enough for things to start switching for me? So I'll let you guys know. <laughs> Because, <laughs> like, I'm keeping my eyes out for, like, some wild stuff. But then a part of me, too, I'm just, like, I feel like I can create the result that I want. So why am I just leaving it up to fate when it's me who can create what I want? And that is my fate. 
me just realizing that I can do that and then creating the life for myself. That's where I'm at. And like, as usual, I will keep you guys posted. See what the energy is right now because your girl's feeling hella wild. <laughs> She's just here for it. She's just, she's here for her mom. What's the energy around me in the collective right now? Like, what's the vibes? What's the message around the block? Yeah, I was kind of playing around a little bit. I was because I'm here making money that I, I sincerely felt like was nothing because of my mindset, guys. Like, I'm telling you, I felt like I just didn't pull at all. And, but that's like a goal of mine. Like I literally have it written down. In the November, my goal, 13K month of income. Right there, 13K month of income. I made 16 last month. So then I put a little plus sign. I'm like, that's me. I, I, I was fooling with myself. Fooling with myself. I have my ships in the background. I have, things going on and what am I looking at? I'm just looking at this juggling of, I don't need to juggle. I made, I made almost $17,000 last month. I had a very enjoyable month, but I felt like I was in poverty. I felt hustling, trying to pay bills and feed my kids and support their needs. That's not me. I don't need to think like that. Every need that I have is taken care of by the universe. Every want is handled for me because I asked for it and I know that I get it and I know that I deserve it. And then Knight of Pentacles, that's what your girl got. That's the vibe. That's the vibe that's coming in. Knight of Wands, manifestation, magic powers, fast. I don't know if I'm crazy, but like, it makes sense to me. It makes sense to me. Leave in the comments if it makes sense to you too because I'm here for it and like, I have 77 subscribers right now, so I see that you're here for it too. And much love to you guys for that. It's so dope that we're building a community on the internet. This is, it's been my goal. I just want to create a safe space on the internet for people who feel like this, who can just talk about it, share it, channel it, do spell work for people, just like send love on people, like just good vibrations. Like, and I feel it from you guys. And I feel it when you like my videos and I feel it when you subscribe and just do that, do that energy exchange, you know? It doesn't always have to look monetary, but if you want it to, you can go check out my website. I have lots of magic on there for you to take a look at. Universal love, mwah.